Hello and happy decluttering season! To kick off this year's decluttering projects, we are actually going to begin in Jose's closet right behind me here. Because Jose got a new job this year, we are going to be doing out with the old and in with the new as we replace his new work wardrobe with his old one. So if you need closet decluttering and reorganization help, then follow along with me and let's declutter our closets together. Let's take a look at what we're working with. Because of Jose's new job, we are finding that there are so many good changes happening. And besides switching over his wardrobe to better match his new work needs, we are also finally going to be embarking on a complete room transformation. If you've been watching my channel for a while, you may know that I refer to this room as the side room, and its main purpose is to act as a catch-all room. Because of that, this room has pretty much been the bane of my existence, trying to keep it decluttered and think of a proper use for it. Now that Jose will be working in IT, he actually needs a home office, and so that's what this room is going to become. Before we can officially create the office, it needs a good and thorough clean-out and declutter. So if that's something you are interested in watching, then subscribe to my channel since I will definitely be documenting that room makeover. I'm starting this closet declutter first by removing all of the hanging clothes and sorting them into piles of like item, t-shirts, button-ups, long sleeves, and outerwear. I also have too many clothes of my own and some of mine have infiltrated the other half of this closet. I'm just going to get those out of here and we'll save that for when we declutter my closet next. Also stay tuned for that video because my closet is way worse than this one. Next step is I'm going to go through one pile at a time and hold them up to Jose and he says either keep, get rid of, or try on. These ones up here are the keeps, down here we have a going away pile started, and these are the ones that he needs to try on before deciding. We used to have to wear so much concert black and formal clothes in college when getting our music degrees, but we don't need to dress up like that as much anymore, so we can definitely narrow down these ties. The next step I'm doing here is a little tedious, but I love how it turned out. I'm actually switching all of the hangers to be of the same color instead of them being mix and match. It's amazing how making one minor change like that can really improve the look of organization in your closet. Next up, I set Jose to work on going through these shelves that hold some books and mainly just backup technology stuff. After organizing it, this pile will go back on the shelves and this stuff is being decluttered. Now that the closet is put back together, all that's left is to gather up all of our going away items. In 
then of course Jose and Daisy took a well-deserved break. Here's how the closet looked before, and here it is after decluttering. We even organized the clothes by type starting with t-shirts, flannel button-ups, long sleeves and sweaters, and then outerwear and formal that way. If this video inspired you to get some decluttering done, don't forget to like this video and leave me a comment answering the question, what part of your house needs decluttering the most? Thanks so much for watching and until next time, bye.